so hi sorry to pause the video but i just wanted to quickly say that if you want to download this banner it will be in the link in the description just go ahead and go to the website and download my newest uh, product it's free uh, called the gfx pack and it will be one of the uh, gfx packs um thank you all right so once you open this psd file up what you want to do is actually change the text right so this is template but you want your own name so i'll be typing aerial effects in this text layer however uh there will be a little problem that will happen and so when you're when you try to change the text here the font actually changes because photop re recognizes that the, uh, it doesn't have that font to change so what you want to do is actually get that font into photop right so what you want to do if you want that is to actually download the font that was given right here so i'll be putting the font download link in the description and the font you the font name i used in this uh, template uh, banner is called product sans bold italic i think and what you want to do is click the text right here and then go ahead and click character right here that says cha and then go here select the little font selection here and then click load font and then select the font that was used right here and then click open and it says load product sans bold italic also next time you use photo p and all that just click ok and boom that should be working now so then now that that works you can freely change your name like this and there we go lastly you want to export this so how to do that is to click file on the left top and go ahead and click save as psd or if you want it you if you want to save it as a png or a jpeg go ahead and click export as so in today's tutorial i'll be exporting it as png so go ahead and click here and then use 100 percent quality and you can use the default um default size because that's probably the size that was used in the actual composition so uh, after you've done that go ahead and just save here and then it will be downloaded into your downloads folder and yeah that's pretty much it thank you so much for watching guys i really hope you guys enjoyed or at least learned something new today uh, make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications to never miss an upload thank you